Konami just released the greatest card ever printed in history, ever made. This right here is better than Electromite, and I'm gonna explain why. I already, already did the research. I already have the combo. Doing it. I'm doing it. Yeah. Yeah. Can some of these? Can some of these? Almost there. I want you to put the news out there. We're back up, and Pendulum is once again the best deck. Pendulum. 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 This card is better than Electromite confirmed. And I'm gonna explain why. You could make your own decision at the end of this video. I already have the combo complete. This card is the best card ever printed, ever. I'm not kidding. I'm gonna explain why. Now, before you think it's clickbait, it's not clickbait. This card is, once I tell you this combo, you'll just, I don't even need Electromite anymore. I'm playing pure Magic Spectres, that's it. This card is that good. For starters, Magic Spectres can officially be played with 15 hand traps. That's for starters. Next, I'm gonna explain everything about the new cards. This it changes everything. The first part of this effect is irrelevant. You wanna know why? I'm never playing any other deck other than Magic Spectres with this. Like, like with this card being that broken, I totally understand that they will have this lock. I, I'm not like, I, I'm not I'm not gonna say I'm glad it happened. I understand this card is a custom card. This is not a real card. I'm gonna explain what it does and how like it works. It's not just a plus four. And th that sounds ridiculous if you listen to what I just said. It's a plus four just by reading the card. When you hear the actual end result, it's more, which is just nuts. I'm gonna explain all the all the new support. The main part of this effect says when this card is link summoned, you can add up to two face up Magic Spectre Pendulum Monsters from your extra deck to your hand. It's already nuts just, just by saying, let me add two monsters. Electromite only adds one monster. Electromite only adds one monster. This adds two monsters. Now you might be thinking, all right, but Triff, you're not gonna have Magic Spectres in the extra deck. How do you think you made this card? You make this card one card. There is 15 cards in Yu-Gi-Oh. I don't even have enough fingers for hands for how many we have. 10 and I'll show you 15. Okay? There's a new combo now. You go normal summon Magic Specter Bombuku. Effect. Search Magic Specter Porcupine. <laughs> this is this is a custom card, but they're both custom. Magic Specter Crow. Search the new emergency teleport of the deck. The effect of this will then summon Bambuku and this. What this card says, I was literally, before I re read this card, all I saw was a Magic Spectre monster with only a monster effect. And all I'm thinking is, before I read the card, what do Magic Spectres need? Please be a special summon. Please. Like, that would change this deck entirely. In crazy telepathic, telepathic fashion. During the main phase, if you control a Magic Spectre monster, quick effect, you can special summon this card. So now when you go Bunbuku or Magic Spectre Crow, it gets into this. And then this says, if this card is normal or special, you can target a Magic Spectre spell and set it. So then you reset the e -telly so you could use it again on the opponent's turn. All right? Keep that in mind so far. And now you have two Magic Spectres on board. And I'm not making Electromite, even if it's legal. I'm making this. And then this adds back the two Magic Spectres that's already in the extra deck from Bambuku or Crow and this. And keep in mind, you have Prosperity, you have Magic Spectre Pegasus, you have multiple e you have 15 ways to this combo. One card, 15, 15 one card combos, and you play 15 hand traps. Then you play the other Magic Spectres as well. And you can't Valor or Imperm any of these Magic Spectres, and you can't Ash the Link. You can't Ash the Link. No one even plays Valor or Imperm. You can't Ash the Link. Now it gets crazy, but we already decided and figured out that this card, add, like this card is a one card Magic Spectre. You with me? I'm gonna give you guys the serious goo here. The one card Magic Spectre. It's made from Bunbuku and this. Now this is where it gets nuts. Konami made it. So the only way to one card combo this out, the scales are fixed. This is a scale two. Magic Spectre Bunbuku is a scale five. Magic Spectre Crow is a scale five. They did that on purpose. That way you one card combo them out of your 15 one card combos. Every Magic Spectre is now Math Max Circular. They're all Magic Spectre Circular now. Into this and then this adds back scales. It adds back the scales. One card adds scales. Then you're thinking, all right, what the fuck am I gonna pen summon, Pen God? Konami answered your prayer. Then you can add up to two Magic Spectre Pendulum Monsters with different names from your deck to your extra deck. Now, I told you in the beginning of the video, this card's better than Electromite. How many cards does Electromite add back from the extra deck? One. This adds back two. How many cards does Electromite send from the deck to the extra deck? One. This sends two. What the fuck? 
I wasn't kidding. This is better than Electromite. This is not like clickbait. I'm serious. And then the two cards that it sends, you're not done yet. Because the Magic Spectre cards are great, perfect scales, you then pen summon Magic Spectre Trap Searchers. Then you special summon Magic Spectre Toad and Fox and search strike and tornado you're still not done by the way so it's one card plus seven already one card plus seven you have a set e-telly you have a set two traps if you want to play rescue ace after reading these you're you're literally just not a human being that with sentience you're you're just not fully there if you're playing rescue ace and not this this sets three automatically okay it's not done yet by the way it, we're still not done. I still didn't even get to the best part. And we just plus seven and went into three interruptions. We're still not done. Then they released the Magic Spectre XYZ. It's pretty decent. And I'm going to show you how to resolve this twice. This card says specifically, you can only use the first effect twice. You already know any effect that says twice or thrice is not fair. You already know this. I have a combo that resolves this twice. And then I know what you're thinking. All right, Petriff, why would I want a special Magic Spectres on my turn and my opponent's turn? You leave this card in the field and the E-Telly that you just reset tributes specifically as does the field spell. Tribute. You're going to be specialing Bunbuku on both turns. We're still not done. Just when you thought this couldn't get any crazier. Like this is a one card, Solemn Strike, Magic Spectre Tornado, E-Telly set, set you get more magic specters out and you can still do more plays magic specter draco slayer card is always always a magic specter so that also gets to all this combo as well magic specter draco slayer is gonna be the deck and i still didn't get to the best part yet you ready this is gonna we're gonna end the video after this because we're gonna mic drop right now this is where it gets unreal all right great triff you just went plus seven from one card you have 15 hand traps wonderful but like there's some meat missing of the deck sure you, you have a bunch you have a whole field of magic specters you have a whole field of magic specters that can't be targeted or destroyed you're plussing three every turn on the opponent's turn you're doing the same shit because you're specially bambuku searching from bambuku and on the opponent's turn this xyz is resolving on your turn and your opponent's turn so you're resolving this xyz multiple times per turn and you're specialing for free but what what are you specialing is the question this is where i'm gonna mic drop and end the video special summon one level six or lower not four i wonder what level six is in this deck that's a weird spellcaster that's where we're gonna mic drop this video. That's the meat this deck is missing. Kieran, Kieran, coming back, confirmed. This deck is tier zero.